the couple who reveled in the joy of the moment danced together to the altar with friends and relatives who came to celebrate with them. They pledged to bring up the twins in the fear of God. Earlier, in a sermon, Pastor Chris Onumejo, who officiated, admonished the couple to trust solely in God to provide all they would need for the upbringing of their children. He said, children were precious and tender gifts from God and if well nurtured, would bloom like trees producing the needed fruits at the right time. The clergyman, along with the congregation, offered special prayers to God for the babies. A reception was later organized at the residence of the couple. Some of the guests joined the couple on the dance floor. In an interview, the couple expressed gratitude to God for the gift of children while praying God to bless others in the need of the fruit of the womb. Friends and well-wishers who spoke, including staff of Delta Broadcasting Service, ASABA, wish the babies well in their lives ahead. So practically, objectively, we're looking at the situation whereby God has really answered your prayers. And to God be the glory, I have a very wonderful family, a wonderful wife, and three lovely kids. Anything is possible if you believe. Just like I said initially, I prayed for a child. It doesn't mean that when you pray today, you expect something today. Some happens now, some happens later, but keep your faith alive, be expectant. God is there to always answer you. My wish is that uh, they will grow strong in marriage and that like, children will that children will you know, grow in the fear of the Lord. Hello. Uh, so the advice I have for them is for him to uh, keep being the person that he is. Uh, for him to be able to stay uh, up to this time means that if he continues the way he is, uh, definitely uh, the sky will be their limit. So just uh, keep being who you are, Meshach, and um, that's the good, the good husband that you are. Others advise the couple to seek the hand of the Lord in raising the children. Mo fe amoma for deadline. <laughs>